In this video, I'm going to discuss sampling and sampling distribution. And this will be the part 2 of our discussion in this topic. And our objective is to identify sampling distributions of statistic. To give you an example, suppose a jar contains number 1, 3, and 5. If we take two numbers in succession with replacement, then the possible two number samples are 1, 1, 1, 3, 1, 5, 3, 1, 3, 3, 3, 5, 5, 1, 5, 3, and 5, 5. If x denotes the mean of the pairs, then uh, the random variable x contains 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And these 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, as I have said earlier, is the mean or are the mean of the pairs that we obtain when we draw two numbers from 1, 3, and 5. And its probability distribution will be First, we have here uh, the mean, 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. And its corresponding probability is for 1, 1 over 9, for 2, 2 over 9, for 3, 1 third, because it is 3 over 9 and it is expressed in simplest form. That is why it became 1 third. For 4, we have 2 over 9. For 5, we have 1 over 9. And this probability distribution of the sampling mean is called sampling distribution. Sampling distribution is the probability distribution of the sampling mean. So here we are going to construct the sampling distribution. How are we going to construct the sampling distribution? So we have here construct the sampling distribution of the sample means when two dice are rolled. As you can see, these are the faces of the die, of a die, also this. And we have here uh, 1 and 1 as 1 because the mean of 1 and 1 is 1. For 2, we have here 2. For 3, we have here 3. For 4, we have here 4, 5, and 6. Now, uh, what we are going to do on our... Uh, synchronous meeting perhaps is to fill out these numbers or fill out uh, this table rather by numbers which is the mean of uh, the number on the top and the number to the left now uh, this one is the sampling distribution but it is not yet complete okay we still have uh, some cells to fill out and we are also to, de to determine its corresponding probability.